Driver Graham McKittrick of car number five was on Sunday crowned the overall winner of this year's edition of the Rhino Charge Off-Road Challenge held in Torose, Kajado County. McKittrick, who is a regular competitor in the Rhino Charge Challenge, covered the tough course under the super modified category of 27 kilometers to emerge victorious for the fifth time in the history of the Rhino Charge. Car number 38, Bundu Fundi, led by Sean Avery and and car number 33, Team Huzi, led by Jeremy Holly, finished second and third. The annual event, which raises funds for environmental conservation, has this year broken the record by raising a remarkable 325.9 million shillings, the highest in the history of the Rhino Charge. Mm. MPESA Foundation, again through the chair, where we sponsored another uh, 60. This win means a lot. Um, all of them are special. To finish the event is one thing and extremely, extremely emotional. Um, super happy about that. But then to win it is, is special. They don't, they don't come often. So to, to have the win is really important. But this event has attracted more support than ever. We were over 4,000 people attending here at the Rhino Charge. But at the same time, the Rhino Charge has, has done the, the level best to raise as much funds as possible towards the conservation of uh, Kenya mountain forest to the Ranwak uh, charitable trust that I'm representing uh, uh, today. Uh, and we are, we are so delighted to, to say that uh, this year, we have raised an amount never expected before. The money for us is part of our net zero commitment where we aim to grow five million trees. And this money is in partnership because the rhino uh, charge will fence the forest, then as we do this, we come in, we grow our 5 million trees, which contributes to the net zero ambition of Safaricom by 2030, while at the same time contributing to Kenya's national tree cover.